Hello lovelies and welcome back to Mama G Gear. It's Mama G here and uh, I'm doing some unboxings and on this video I have stuff from this is from um, Ophire Company, Ophir, whatever you want, however you want to. I'll hold this up and you can see the sticker hopefully. Okay. I hope you could see the sticker with all this uh, glitz and glimmer from the bag. And these I bought, um, not turning it over because it's my home address. And I bought these. Um, they they were, they're a limited edition and they brought them back. I missed the original uh, availability to them. And then they brought them back for a short period and I grabbed them. And now they're having a super sale, another 25% off. So I did not get the 25% off. Oh, cool. That's interesting. All right, let's see what we got here. These are, of course, crochet hooks. And a little thank you with a code thing. Cool. All right, this is really cool. I've seen these in plastic bags. I didn't see them in these before. That's really neat. All right, here we go. The I, I paid $15 each. So then there's, of course, shipping. and t I'm not showing you that because it has my uh, address on there. All right. They're all the same. That's oh, wood. This is really cool. It's got a little... They sprayed it. Am I in camera here, I hope? It's got leather and I... Oh, my gosh. I'm really excited about the packaging. All right, they're, all four of them are the same, but different sizes. Two of them are the size six hook. And these are the Barbie collection. Oh, come on, folks. Look at that. That's a Barbie hook. It's not as long as a furls, but it's definitely long enough where it's not going to be hitting uh, that part of my hand because that's the biggest problem I have with hooks is that it hits this part of my hand. I don't know if you ever notice, guys, that my palms are red often, and I don't really know why that is, but they do get irritated if uh, something's, you know, like anybody, if you've got a hook and it keeps stabbing you, it, it hurts. It's uncomfortable, but these are really cool. And yeah, uh, Dee's from Cre Dee's Creative Hand pointed out that they do have that sharp tip, which I like because you could really dig into your... Um, next stitch i'm not they, these are really nice i'm really happy with that so this is a size six i have two size sixes i think i got a five and a seven and um i'm gonna of course keep a couple for myself because they're barbie hello and then i i grabbed the two sixes because i thought i can give one as a giveaway prize but yeah i love the love the um the packaging I almost want to like kind of do that. Does that make a like a thumbnail? <laughs> Me and my thumbnails. I'm such a weirdo. But yeah, that's really cool. Let's see. I'm banging around, making noise. I should stop playing with these things, right? Does that make a thumbnail? I don't know. Maybe I'll go over like there. How's that? Yay! Beautiful. All right. Anyway. All right. The next thing um wanted to open up. Oh. Nah, I'm going to have to blur that out now. The next thing I want to open up is an order from a company that is one, one good, I don't remember the name of the company. The bags are not dirty from the company. They're dirty from the back of the truck. All right. I got a box and a few bags. This is going to be somewhat boring for you because they're all the same. They're all whirly gig. I love my new favorite, Whirly Gig Super. If you've not touched Whirly Gig yarn, you need to come over and have coffee and touch my Whirly Gig because it is so soft. Um, yeah, Cascade Yarns. Absolutely love this. 60% 60 60 Superwash Merino, 20% Nylon, and 20% Acrylic. 200 grams, 546 yards or 500 meters per cake machine wash and tumble dry which i wouldn't do but you could this as you can all right i had gotten a couple cakes of this fell completely in love with it because i'm still devastated about the mandala tweed stripes being discontinued and went and found this actually it was connie wagner had told me where where to go 
<laughs> well, a lot of people tell me where to go, but she was telling me where to go to get this yarn. So um, there's a little tag in here. Oh, just says hello and thank you. Yeah. So what I did was, if you bear with, there's a box too, but I'm going to go real quick. So I don't want to keep you all night or day, whatever it is, while you're watching this. There's another one they just sent. It was a shame because they really, I always feel bad when companies do this because they really could just have waited. I'm not in a hurry to get one bag and the next. Just get it all and then send it all in one package, you know. But I got a couple different colors. All right, here's a different color. Oh, that's pretty. And the packaging is so dirty. All right, so that's the bags. Let me, I'm going to take the box off of here. Just hold on there, folks. I just want to show you the different colorways. All right. Oh my gosh, the tape is stuck to my hand. There we go. Sorry, wrapping. Oh, wait a minute. What the heck's that? Oh. Okay, well, anyway, the name of the company is not on here. One happy, one big happy yarn company. That's what it was. One big happy yarn company because the, their return address thing just has like the initials. So we've got four, four of this one, four of this. Let's see what the other color is. And then there's another really cool yarn. Oh my God, look at how gorgeous. We'll get to that. Just hang in there, folks. Hang in there. I know. I'm a mess. There's four of those. There's five of that. All right, that's interesting. And five of that, but the four of that one. Am I missing a... I'm usually pretty consistent. Maybe there's another bag that's missing, and again, I don't have an invoice. So I'm going to have to recheck. Okay, and then this thing here in my hand, I'll show you that in a sec. Okay, so the very soft, super awesome Whirly Gig, this colorway is i'll do this quick hopefully hopefully where don't tell me they don't have oh, i guess they don't have uh names this is colorway number 15 which is reds this looks like a brownish red really super cool what i'm noticing on here on this one it's not all solid there's variations of it in this red so that might i don't notice it so much in the other ones so this might have that by accident or maybe there's more in the other ones and I got apparently got four of those that doesn't make sense because I usually do the same because there's five of each of these I right, just stop obsessing over it woman and this colorway which apparently is numbers is number 14 really cool this is more rusty speed right here look at those colors right orange teal green tan brown yeah totally cool and then this is my colorway right here my god and the colorway on this one is number 18 and again there's 546 yards per cake and i literally have a whole little cubby square just for my really gigs <laughs> because I was waiting for these to come. I, I'm assuming there might be one more of the other color coming. Let's just do this. Look at all those cool colors. That's gorgeous. That makes me happy. That's why I'm doing all the yarn on my Zen Den because this just makes me really super happy to look at that and to feel it. So definitely come over for coffee and touch my really gigs. And then I grabbed one of these apparently. Very interesting. I love the writing. This is Noro. All right, let's 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 surround myself with the pretty purples. There we go. All right, this is a thing. I, I don't, don't know if I ever had Noro. I might have. I, I don't remember. But here's a Noro. Uh, the World of Nature, made in Japan. I don't know how to read Japanese. This is 50% silk. 25% wool and 25% polyamide. It's a 200 gram ball. And I'm not seeing yardage. It's a two weight. So some of you that know, you know, with the weight and the 
uh, ounces could figure out how many yards it is. I'm not seeing how many yards it is, but there's probably a lot of yards. It probably says that in here, but isn't that gorgeous? It's just browns and grays. And it's a thinner, uh, a thinner weight, but that's all right. I'm getting, I'm, I'm getting better uh, at crocheting and finding that I'm enjoying using thinner yarns now. Before I liked a thicker yarn because you could go quick. Uh, now I don't mind taking a little time to make something. I'm starting to appreciate the whole process more than just, you know, running, getting through it. But anyway, yeah, I've got a, a little um, donut of Noro and lots of really gigs. So that was my unboxing for today. We got some, some hooks, some Barbie hooks. I think I might be missing one of the cakes on here, on this colorway. I'm not even on camera, uh, but I, whatever. I'm not going to worry about it, but right? How nice. Yeah, I'm like a hot mess today. I'm doing a Dawn Aaron hot mess. Dawn A! <laughs> hey, I love you guys. Don't forget the thummies. Uh, they're really important and uh, totally appreciate you hanging out with me. Um, I think that's it for the unboxings for a while because I unboxed about a minimum of 10 things, I think, because some of them I did off camera. So, uh, yeah. I'm going to stop buying now for the end of, till the end of the year, which is only like another 30 days or something around there. Anyway, guys, I love you. Uh, have an Olicious day. Be well, and we will see you next time. Bye-bye for now.